Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to talk about whether or not the tricep kickback is an effective exercise at hitting the triceps. Now, that's not to get confused whether you like it or not, because I've heard so many people over the years talk about, well, I like that exercise, I don't like that exercise. It's not about whether you like it or not, it's whether it's effective. So, in the next coming uh, month or two, I'm going to go over different videos uh, for a number of different exercises for the triceps, biceps, chest, lats, hamstrings and glutes, quads, and just kind of like a series of exercises uh, specifically on one exercise like today's tricep kickback and whether it's a good exercise or not. So if you have any uh, confusion about that, hopefully I will clear it up for you. Uh, if not, ask, you know, ask me questions. That comment box is below and uh, I'll be happy to help you out. All right, for this example, I'm going to show you with a 15 pound dumbbell. Uh, the amount of weight doesn't really matter. I'm not doing an ego lift. And what I mean by that, and you've all seen guys like this at the gym, grab too much weight that they can't handle and then they just swing it. Well, they don't even know what muscle group they're supposed to be working because for a lot of different body parts, if you use way too much weight, you're going to get a lot of muscle groups helping it. So I tried to do this at the gym today, but I couldn't film because I went to one, two, three different gyms. One gym I went to twice and it was just too crowded. Uh, I could typically film at those gyms if it's less crowded, but today, I'm glad it was Monday, people. It was a cooler weather. It's 60 degrees here in Florida. For us, that's cold. Um, I'm in my patio here, semi-long sleeve because it's cold. Uh, but the, once again, Florida. So uh, I'm going to use my kicking bag here, not to kick it but to brace my back, so I lean against it slightly, bring that elbow up, and extend outwardly. Just like that. Now by doing this, I am really hitting those parts of my tricep. So yeah, in my professional opinion, in 29 years doing this, the tricep kickback is a very effective exercise. If done properly, with a weight that you can handle and use with good form, it's going to be a good one for the triceps. Um, the other way to do it besides using a dumbbell is if you've seen the uh, adjustable cable uh, that could start low, medium, high, and a bunch of different settings in between. You could lower that with a handle or not with that handle. Uh, a lot of them have that little safety ball on it. You could grab that and do the kickback as well. Usually do it about waist height. Somewhere chest to waist height should be good enough for you. Grab that and do a kickback. The good thing about having cable is that you have the tension on the 100% of the range of motion where with the dumbbell it's usually 85 to 90% of the range of motion you have tension on the muscle. So it depends on what you have. If you're at home and you don't have the ability to use a cable attachment then you might have to use a dumbbell and that might be more effective for what you're trying to do and what you have available. So hopefully this video was helpful. Don't forget like, subscribe, share if you can. Uh, I'm sure you can. All you need is a finger to push the button. Pretty easy. So uh, I appreciate it. It does help my channel. Every time you hit the like button, every time, if, well, you could only subscribe once, but you know what I mean. It definitely helps. And so uh, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.